For this lesson, I'm going to cover Demilitarized Zone, DMZ. So what is a DMZ? A DMZ is the area of the network where you place your internet services, such as email server, FTP server, or web server, that you want available for the public to access. Companies will use a DMZ for websites that host certain services and information for both current and potential clients. A public FTP server on the DMZ might serve files to all users or only certain clients. Mail servers on a DMZ might serve to provide mail access for your own users or who might be using the system remotely. If the web server on your DMZ is compromised, then the hacker can only affect what's inside the DMZ and not your internal LAN, local area network, which is separate and protected by a firewall. Typically, a DMZ is placed between the public internet and protected zone, your private network. So here, let's take a look at the image on the right. As you can see, here you have your local area network at the IP address of 172.29.0.0. And then here you have your firewall that's protecting you from the internet, the untrusted network. And then here you have the DMZ that's residing away from the local area network, your internal network. And the DMZ has your web server and your FTP server. So again, if an attacker comes and compromises the DMZ, it will not be able to compromise the local area network because, again, the DMZ and the local area network are on two different sides. Well, I hope you enjoyed this. That's all I have for DMZ. Thank you for watching.